Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. I have a story to tell you today about Centrum multivitamin and mineral. Uh, do you know it's very popular and I've been using it for years off and on and the funny thing about it is that when I start using vitamins including Centrum and, and other types of vitamins um, regularly. I've noticed over the years very shortly I start feeling a sense of lesser well-being and over the years I've always found that when I then stop with the vitamin regimen uh, that I begin to feel a greater sense of well-being once more and I, I just couldn't because I I have so many vitamins on the list, I just couldn't peg it to a particular vitamin until quite recently I became very determined about it. I eliminated all the vitamins except for Centrum. Centrum multivitamin for women that I bought at Walmart. Okay, and so I tried that for about a week, using it once every few days. And I continued with this sense that all was not right with my body, you know. So I stopped, and then the sense of well-being returned. So, so now what I had was Centrum, for me personally, anecdotally, Centrum is the trouble. So how could that be with one of the most popular vitamins in the entire United States? How could that possibly be? So just I looked up the, where it was manufactured, it was the first idea is maybe it's manufactured in a foreign country. Like, for instance, some of these fruits that have been recalled from the market recently were produced in other countries. Some were produced here. I thought, could be that, that the country of origin might have lower standards for producing uh, Centrum than, than might be the case with vitamins here in the United States. That was my thought. So I looked it up, and it turns out it's produced by Pfizer, which also produces the most popular COVID medicine. But the place of manufacture was a place called Suzhou, which is about 100 miles to the west of Shanghai and north of Taiwan. Yes, I got it. And I looked up the pictures on it, and it looked to me like it was a very low-lying land. And then I found out that there's a problem with their, their canals instead of streets, and there's a problem with sewage going into the canals, and so therefore the water source possibly might be a problem. This was all supposition. So, so then I thought, well, I will throw out the centrum. I will take that bold move and throw out the centrum, and I will look around for a multivitamin for women that's manufactured in the United States with United States ingredients. And after searching around for a while on Amazon, I found one. And I have to say that, just speaking anecdotally from my own personal experience, the minute that I, I received that in the mail, I took out a couple of tablets, a couple of capsules, and held them in my hand. You know I'm sensitive to things like the feel of, of medicines, the feel of foods, I can tell whether they're going to be good for me or not good for me just by holding them in, in my palm or, or even putting my hand out, you know. I remember one time in a, I was in a parking lot of a shopping center and a young man approached me. This is pertinent to this. And he was holding something like a vitamin pill in his hand. He had a look. He, he had me on edge. And he asked me if I wanted any. And I could feel from a distance something radically wrong with him as regards my own personal health, you know, so I, it was like, um, it made me very hyper, even though I was a foot away, I could feel like an overstimulation of my nervous system, like uh, uppers, I guess, and, and so I begged off, and so with these pills that I got, these vitamin pills that I got from the Midwest, in the United States, 
I held two in my hand and I could feel that sparkling energy that happens when something is really good for the physical body. So I gave it a try. In the same regime of a, 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 a dose of two capsules a couple times a week. And so far it's been perfectly fine. So uh, I don't know if for me there's trouble with the fillers in Centrum or there's a problem with the ingredients, the way that they're obtained, whether they're pure, whether they're the true ingredients or not, or not, or the right proportions of ingredients. I don't know if it has to do with the water or the air quality or the quality of the earth and the place where the ingredients are obtained, but I, I do feel for me personally there's something wrong there. I would suggest if it, if you're experiencing that same kind of situation, um, just go ahead and and give something made in the United States a chance, American ingredients and American manufacture, because we have some of the highest quality standards in the entire world as far as food consumption is concerned. Yeah. This is a caveat. Uh, this is only my personal experience as an a wellness sensitive, uh, medical intuitive. This is only my personal sense of Centrum. I realize there are those who might take it poorly and it, Centrum may work very well for them. It might be a characteristic of the light worker body. So, so please don't think that I'm trying to injure Centrum. It's just that I have a concern for those of us who are sensitives, who are light workers, that we should maintain our physical forms in the very best of health. This way of thinking, uh, of course, applies to all the food that we eat and all the water that we drink, the physical exercise that we get, the length of time that we sleep. So, I, I hope I've explained that sufficiently. Yeah, so, that's my hint for today. God bless you all and keep you safe and be with you through all your days. In love, light, and joy, this is Alice B. Claggett. I am of the stars, and so are you. Take good care of your health. Until next we meet, happy holidays. Check out my website, Awakening with Planet Earth, https colon slash slash awakeningwithplanetearth.com. See you there. Uh